boom in India. Okay, uh, even if discounting went away, e-commerce is going to boom. Okay, because the paradox of India is that we need convenience more than anybody. Okay, so e-commerce is about convenience. Okay, uh, in delivery, it's about choice and it's about the price. Right, in some sense, the, and India needs all three. Uh, and I think there'll be many winners across the Indian landscape. I don't think it's a winner-take-all game here because we as Indians are very value-seeking. Uh, we're, we're going to find ways in which we, we kind of buy from many, many, many different uh, avenues. Uh, I think it's not going to be only e-commerce either. It's going to be also off, offline. It's going to be a, a good omni-channel kind of experience sure. in India, right? So to answer your question, I think, you know, listen, e-commerce is going to grow. I think don't be surprised if you know, we had some little pullback in terms of funding, but that's just for the top 10, 20 companies, right? I think the rest of the ecosystem is going to grow, and even those, the wave will come back. It's like a tide that maybe goes back for a little bit and it comes back. It's not the ocean is not disappeared. Uh, uh, are they utilizing the social media space uh, effectively, or is there an opportunity that they are not utilizing? See, I think using something effectively is a relative term, right? I mean, uh, I think obviously in when people spend money on social media, when they uh, go out and leverage social media for organic kind of uh, content and uh, reach, uh, they do it with uh, some set of goals. And sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. I think the, the thing about social media is, is a lot of experimentation happens. So you might see a lot of things that don't stick. Right. And don't and that fail, but don't let that uh, uh, you know deter you. Don't let that mislead you into believing social media is not working for those companies. Okay, right. because they they'll then be amplifying the things that work, and you'll see a lot of that. Uh, I think you know you just got to be ready to experiment, and the the whole nature of experimenting is you'll have failures. Right, you'll have setbacks. Right, otherwise you shouldn't experiment at all. <laughs> you just go down the well trodden path. Right. Uh, or whatever the template is that that, that is of a template of success, right? But that's not going to give you disruptive, uh, uh, you know, results, right? And, and better outcomes. So, I'd say you know, you, social media is a fantastic uh, avenue and a platform for young companies to leverage. Uh, I think they should do it fearlessly. They should do it astutely because you you can't uh, just make noise. It has to be highly relevant. It's a targeted audience that you can go after. Uh, and if you do that well, you can really gain a lot, right? right. So, do you have any um, e-commerce, uh, any companies who's um, using social, amazing some examples of it? I think we had two two great examples on stage today. Uh, you know, Fresh Menu and Big Basket. I think both of them are uh, using social media excellent. Uh, I see them in my feeds at least a lot, and uh, that's good. Uh, you know, because they're very uh, targeted in how they uh, they, they they put out uh, both uh, organic and paid. Uh, collateral, I think, you know, and they've got good people on their teams, I, I suspect, right, that they're being able to deliver those results. Uh, I think it comes down to really talented people who understand how social media works, what the levels there are, and what it takes to amplify, right? And I think they're doing it well. I think those are two good examples. Right. So you, your thing is um, real time and bots, you talked about a lot of things. Um, now, um, uh, do you think that in India, specifically, um, these companies will adapt to all these these things. Of course, of course. I mean, you know, listen, Indian founders are super smart. Okay? Right. Uh, but that that doesn't mean everybody has to embed a bot tomorrow right. into their product, right? I mean, you do it when it's relevant, when it's useful, when you're going to create some consumer delight and utility, right? You don't just do it because it's the cool thing to do, and bots are the thing that are in today. Uh, I think you know, I, I would I would I would strongly urge you. Uh, you know, uh, entrepreneurs to really think through what value they're going to deliver and not just do it because it's fashionable, right? But you're right. I mean, the interactivity uh, is going to be impressive in social media in a few years from now. Uh, it may even be unrecognizable from social media as we have it today.